We're uh, not getting as, like, guards chasing us as much as I thought we would. Which I'm not complaining about, that's great. I think I just combined good and great into one word. Wouldn't surprise me. I do that way too often when I'm trying to write quickly. I think the yesterday morning I combined... I combined something with towards. I don't remember what now. I combine them into the same word and it's just like... No, this is actually something I need to hand in. I need to spell that correctly. Usually I catch it when... Catch myself when I do that. Usually. Oh, it's not in the building, is it? For some reason. No, it's on the other side. I got confused for a second. I thought this was us. I don't know why. Get back. Okay, let's just continue running around. I don't know where Etsy was doing. But yeah, Galavant. Everyone watch it. <laughs> My parents just everywhere today. I love that show. It's like, it's just a little comedy that somehow got a second season. It's amazing, and it deserves a second season, but it was just like, oh wow, the channel actually went, yeah, no, go ahead and make more. It's amazing. So it's just, nope, 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 nope. How does that work? You know nothing? Oh wait, was that where I was supposed to go? I didn't drop from... Nope. I need to sneeze. Oh, sorry about that. Okay, it's on this side building. Oh, pad. I can't do a drop down assassination. What are you doing, camera? Yeah, nothing to see here. Oh great, this is not gonna end well. Especially when I don't have my... <laughs> I guess I can beat them with my fist. I don't think that'll work out too well. I'm not gonna kill you. I'm just gonna kill this guard. Oh shit. Shoot. Alright, sure, let's do this. Wanna fight me? I'll fight you. I just wanna, like, really, you guys just let me into this, like, random office with nobody in it but a chest? I wouldn't need to do this. Come on, just die already. Yay. Why are some of you cheering me? You just watch someone murder six guards. Yeah, they might not be the best guys, but really, you shouldn't be cheering me. <laughs> oh wow, you just starfished. Sorry, chickadee. Yeah, I'm robbing the dead. I don't have that much money. Need all the money I could get. That's gotta make It's over there. Oh, that's that door I saw earlier. What that door is? Oh. Go. Hold it down. Yay, cut a page. We have one more. And then... I don't know why I'm doing these now. Looks like we're not going to be leaving Florence anytime soon because we still got that area, but... I don't know. I really like getting these done as early as possible. Because that uh, saves us some time. Later. Okay. Was that Taylor? Can I dye my clothes yet? Ooh. Can. All these are like red and I love it. I don't know if I like that. Shows. I definitely don't like that. I don't like that yellow. Hmm. Really like that one. Oh well. I'll just save my money for now though. Maybe maybe once I get a little bit more money. Although nothing wrong with having 
If it was armor, that'd be cool, but it's just, just color of the cloak. Should save till I have more money than I can deal with, then I can start just dyeing my clothes whenever. Which could happen at any moment, because I'm good at that. I'm good at getting money in this game. I figured out <laughs> good methods to do it. Other than just, oh, here's a way to get money? Okay, sure, why not? Other than races, because screw races. Where do they cut cloaks like that? Milano. Hey! Hey, did you just assault my cloak? Really? Really, dude? Really, dude? You seriously, both you just fuck it. Like, this guy's the only one that knew what's up, and he still died. Oh, shoot. Seriously, guys, stop, like, falling into my blade. No, I'm just, like, holding this knife out. It's not a big deal, I'm like, just keep falling into the blade. That blacksmith could give no cares. Like, nope, I just need to get my work done. I'm not gonna get involved in this. Oh, what's with my camera today? I don't have any problems with the shift button today, though. That's good. I say that, I probably just jinxed it. Um, it's not even worth it, but I feel I feel like wrong if I don't loot them. <laughs> I don't know why. I well, didn't turn on the eagle vision. Okay, now let's go do that quest. Doo -doo -doo. Nothing happened here. Nope, nope. No one in a white cloak did anything. And hey, they insulted <coughs> my cloak. Who would do you such a thing? Here, so <laughs> so he is saying <laughs> you're not supposed to be up here, so don't. I love that. Please continue to say that, dude. Make my day. <coughs> Yay. Running, running, running. And fall. Oh. Now what I meant to do. This is Blooming Rose, right? <coughs> oh. Yeah, I think that's what the place is called. Uh, that's one I wanted. Escape. No, I don't know how to immediately get to the quest. You were gone for quite a while. Bernardo likes to talk. Not that stuff to he do. does. But I trust he did more than talk. Ah, I still press the wrong button. I've given you the skills. Leonardo's given you the blade. All that remains. I forgot is the about deed. that time I went to go take Where a drink. Where can I find Uberto? According to my girls, he'll be attending an unveiling tonight of Verrocchio's latest work. It will oops, be held oops. at the Santa Croce cloister. Watch over my mother and sister while I'm away. Of course, Ezio. As if they were my own. I forgot to mute them, or turn the sound off my phone. And of course, the person texts me is the one who sends like three texts when she could just send one. I did not read any of that out loud. I'm sorry. Uh, we're gonna go find this person. Uberto Alberti. Trusted friend of the Auditore family. According to the history books, this guy was a saint. He prosecuted murderers, rapists, the worst criminals. One of the best lawyers in Italy, he won every case. That's impossible. Despite the fact that he was self-taught. Now, I found a back door into the Templar's database server. I've been combing it for some kind of smoking gun. I found it. Apparently, Uberto's family was evicted by the Medici Bank. Uberto's been aching for revenge ever since. And the Templars promised him support. Ezio's father was standing in the way, and Uberto was jealous of his influence over the Florentine government. Two birds with one stone, isn't it? It looks like Uberto used his election to the Signoria as his opportunity to strike. That was not the order they were lined up in, in uh, earlier. But yeah, Uberto Alberti, date of birth 1416. Profession, Galifonaria de Gutsia? No idea what that is. Executor of the Ordinances of Justice. Traitor. <laughs> Justice and traitors should not be listed next to each other. <laughs> Anyways, let's go kill some people, alright? 
It's you. It's you. Thank you. Uh, I saw nothing, guards. You know nothing. You can never get me. I'm the gingerbread man. <laughs> Brain, really? I don't know. I don't know half the time. Okay, let's just. Nope. Are you cowering in here, my friend? No, nope, no, he is not. Ah. Ah, so close. Out of the way! Yay! Fun times. I've lost sight of him. He's not up here, not at all. Nope. Just an innocent little eagle. Yay, fun times. So it's you like just trying to thought, why did you put these clothes on that were in the chest? You just like grab them, you just like put them on. Again with this. You have overstepped your bounds, Uberto. Who are you to speak of bounds? You, who have crowned yourself Lorenzo di Medici, Principe of Firenze. I've done no such thing. Of course not. Ever innocent. How convenient. At least now, we see how far your reach extends, which is to say, nowhere at all. It has proved a valuable lesson for me and my allies. Yes. Your allies, the Pazzi. Is that what this is about? Be careful with your words, Lorenzo. You might attract the wrong sort of attention. Um, I was going to show guard activity on here, but... Is this the building with... No, this was not the building with all the guards. I believe... Um. Truly, I am sorry. Um. What? Why weren't I planning with any of them? This is that's stupid. Okay, come on. Yep. 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 Look at that cape. Look at that cape. Look how cool it is. Do do. Fashion show. Look how pretty at you. I don't have a beard yet. It's weird. I don't know, let's go see. Let's just go see what's on the back of this church. Oh look, no guards. Imagine that. I also don't take this in. Oh, oh. Unless it's just a wall. Oh, it's just a wall. Dang. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, this seems to be working. There we go. What's he got to hide? Oh! Oh! That probably was the most easy I've ever been gotten to this building. I trust you're enjoying yourselves. Indeed, a nice distraction from that nasty business with the auditor. And to think I once thought of Giovanni as brother. Don't! You! <laughs> he just let me walk up and kill him. I doubt that. Yeah, Ezio killed his versus target. You would have done the same to save the ones you love. Yes, I would, and I have. Don't. The auditor, you're not dead. I'm still e Ezio. here. Ezio. Me, Ezio, Ezio auditor. Ezio, that's how you get convicted of murder. Assassino! 
Um, shoot, where am I? Uh, Etu, really, you're just... Look, okay, train of thought, and I'm like, well, not train of thought, because I thought it was before, but, like, Ezio is, like, the worst person to, like, assassinate. He doesn't hide. It's, like, quite obviously, yeah, it's this assassin. There's no doubt about it. And he's just like, I don't know. It's just so easy to know. It's like, yeah, who killed this guy? Oh, it was Ezio. We all know it was Ezio. We just can't find him. It's like, oh, okay, sure. I'll get him one day. <laughs> but everyone, he's like the worst assassin. He kills the target in like the most obvious ways. Yay, money! Oh, letter. Nothing wrong with a good letter. Okay, back. Database. Some entries. Uh, we did that one. Don't care about places. Don't really care about thieves. Do we see what she is all about? Uh, Paula? Date of birth, 1438. Profession, Madame of La Rosa Colta. There isn't much information about Paula. Paula? Paula? I don't know. In the history books, but the Florentine archives reveal that she was an orphan at age 8 when her parents were killed at sea. Left with the choice between joining a nunnery and prostitution, she began a life on the streets. At age 16, she vanishes vanishes from the records only to appear at age 20 when she was arrested for murdering a city guard. On an interesting note, Giovanni Auditore represented her in court, winning the case on a self-defense plea. Released from prison, Paula went on to start her own brothel to protect many other unfortunate women of the street. Hmm. Courtesans, La Rosa, Nita, I think we read stuff about her. Uh, I think so. Uh, date of birth 1407, servant. I thought she was the younger sister. There's like 57, 38. There's a pretty big difference between those two. They can't be, unless she, when she says sister, she means a different kind of sister. Because otherwise, there's some flaw here in the dates of when they were born. Anyways, uh, Autori family live in Servant, and Netta had one of the few respectable jobs allowed lower class Renaissance women. Which family seldom had more than one or two servants. Most were young, sometimes children. Many hoped their masters would help raise their standing, but usually turnover was rapid. Ultimately, very little is known about Anita's life. She passed on without making a mark on history. That's weird. Okay. Um, documents. Yay, codex. Actually, is there anything? I don't think there is anything we can read on the codex yet. Yeah. Soon? Um, nope. How do I get back to the one I was just on? I don't know what just happened. I don't know. I don't know how to scroll. Oh, wait, no, I want to look a letter. After the. My love, I put these thoughts to paper in the hope that I might one day have the courage to share them with you. In time, you'll no doubt learn that I betrayed Giovanni, labeled him a traitor, and sentenced him to die. History will likely judge this to have been a matter of politics and greed. Know that it was not hate that forced my hand, but fear. When the Medici robbed us of all we owned, I found myself afraid. For you, for our son, for the future. What hope in this world for a man without proper means? They offered me money, land, and title in exchange for my collaboration. And so this is how I came to betray my closest friend. However unspeakable the act, it seemed necessary at the time. And even now, looking back, I see no other way. We read all these. As she said. Okay. I'm gonna have to go look up later how to zoom in, because that is actually an important figure. Why? Okay, whatever. That's a weird little J 
checky thing there. Nope, nope, do not mean to rob, do not mean to rob. Whoopsies. 